There are a number of options available to anyone who's currently using a refrigeration system using R22. Um, the, the, the first uh, option available would be to use one of the, the various drop-in refrigerant replacements. Now, what this means is that uh, the, the system uh, would use a different uh, refrigerant and again it would be a, a man-made uh, synthetic refrigerant which would be used in place of R22. Now th this can be an attractive option for anyone whose system uh, still has life left and uh, anyone who's not keen to um, scrap equipment uh, that, that still has um, some residual value. Now the, the challenge comes when uh, looking at drop-in replacements uh, that the, the system will never operate exactly the same as it did when it was using R22. There are issues of material compatibility, uh, looking at uh, seal materials. There are also issues of oil compatibility, and this needs to be um, considered carefully and addressed when any drop-in refrigerant is used. The next thing to consider is uh, the, the overall capacity of the system, because many of the drop-in replacements uh, would have a capacity that is less than the capacity uh, using R22. Finally, uh, the efficiency of the system will almost certainly be affected uh, when using a drop-in replacement and uh, this, this needs to be considered um, to see if, if the, that solution is really the best for, for that system.